Hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. It's Jackie. Hey, I've got a huge haul here and oh, I have to be on the bed. <sighs> so hopefully we're not too rocky. I said that last time, I believe. I have been shopping. I, ha I wanted to finish. Oh, I'm trying to straighten out my leg here. Oh, okay. Let's see what we can do. <sighs> anyway, Sarah had to go to be at Dower Tree at uh, 6 o'clock this morning, and her husband was still at work. So Ron and I got up and took her. However, I never went to sleep. I was so apprehensive about having to go out in the crowds that I couldn't even sleep. Hold on a minute. I'm trying to find something that'll prop this up just a tad. Okay, maybe that'll work. Better. So I'm really tired. He went to take the dog to the dog park, so I thought I'd do my haul real quick while he was gone. And I am going to get started right away. I have no idea what's in what, so bear with me, folks. I hope you're having a great day, and I hope you are getting ready for Christmas. I finally found some lights with white cords for my tree, the little white tree I have at uh, Walmart today. Okay, so I have lots of stuff. I bought some crackers. They didn't have the saltines that I really like, so I bought these instead. And they have the... Chex Mix again in the big bags. I got a uh, regular and a cheddar. And I got my two jars of mushrooms because we were we were out. And just like last haul, I'm going to kind of shove it back in the bag because uh, that way I can get it off the bed. So so when we got to uh, Walmart at 6, eh, it was probably about 6.20, 6.15, something like that. Um, yeah, it was probably close to 6.30 because we stopped at McDonald's. We just went through the drive-thru and got a sandwich and a coffee. And uh, I had to have my coffee. So um, we got there and it didn't look, you know, too bad. And I said, it looks kind of a little bit busy, but not bad. So we both agreed, yes. Well, um, by the time we left it, well, after eight, it was really busy. So we went to the Dollar Tree. And they don't open until eight, so it wasn't too bad in there yet. My daughter said it was wall to wall people. Okay, now, this is from the Dollar Tree. I got a box of chocolates. I actually got two boxes of them, so one of them somewhere else. Um, I got some card holders here. I got a red one, a gold one, and a silver one. And I bought two of these party poppers. Um, in England, they do these on Christmas. But I got these for um, my two granddaughters who have boyfriends. They can do them on New Year's Eve. Um, I got some Kalamati, Kalamata olives, which I love. Uh, Ron picked up some Vienna Bites. He told me he didn't like them, and now all of a sudden he keeps buying them, so I don't know what's that. Um, I bought these in red. I have some white ones at the camper, um, that I use, and I bought these to have it at home. Once he's retired, I would imagine on occasion we'll be taken off in the morning or something. I don't know. Who knows what will be happening. <clears throat> He's only got three more days because he is off through Tuesday and then he'll go back to work Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. He said they have cake and well, there's the other box. No. <clears throat> cake and coffee for the retiree. And he's the only one at the moment. 
And then uh, he said, I'm not even going to go in there until 8 o'clock. He said, you can go in and you get to go in your street clothes. I said, okay. All right. Now, sometimes it might be stuff from Walmart, which I will tell you. Um, I bought two of these from Walmart. Uh, these are for uh, the two granddaughters for New Year's Eve. I don't know what they're doing on New Year's Eve. But, uh, I need to get all that wrapped up and get it out of here. Hold on, guys. Oh, what a janky way to do a... And I can't edit it, so... Uh, this is also from Walmart. And this is a gift. If I can get it back together again. And it is the little old-fashioned Cokes Christmas ones. And uh, I sure don't make cartons like they used to. Um, I had sat around in the liquor store to get some little bottles of Jack Daniels, little, you know, lunch hot things. They didn't have any. They, he got Jim Bean maybe instead. That was all they had. And I, he got four of them, so I'm just going to tie them to the ends of the thing with ribbon. That's for my ex-husband. Because he always, he's always at the, you know, we all are always at the get-togethers together, so. I thought, they've gotten us gifts before. I thought, well, I'll get them something. Oh, goodness, that's heavy. Uh. Okay, maybe I won't have to knock everything off now. Okay, in this bag I got... These are a gift. These are for my son-in-law. He likes red vines. These are for soup, since we didn't have any crackers. I look terrible today, too. I wear a real sloppy sweatshirt. Uh, these are for him. He likes Haribo... Uh, gummy bears. He used to like a different kind, but I like them. And these are the uh, sweet tarp ropes. And I wanted to let uh, Coupon Girl know they changed the packaging, so be looking for it like this instead of the old packaging, or you'll miss it. And I got... They had these two for a dollar, so we got four cans of the uh, fire roasted, their organic fire roasted diced tomatoes. We got four cans of them. That was a good deal. And Ron must have picked up some large pitted black olives. Another Vienna bite. Oh boy, he's going to be a lot of fun when he retires. I wonder why it cost so much when I was when it came to ring up, and he got himself some milk paint. And I got this at Walmart for my daughter's boyfriend's son to go with some other stuff. It's a little axe. I'm truly sorry. But I have got some exciting things to show you guys. First of all, um, and they had another brand too, but this is SG Salon Graphics um, Play It Big Volumizing Dry Shampoo. They had it for brown hair and blonde. And I got two of the blonde. And then there was another brand, another type. And they only had it in brown, so I didn't I even look at it. And it was with a white and green packaging. Um, they had a whole bunch of the beauty benefits stuff out again. And I got this uh, sparkling lip gloss in Mega Shine in Ruby. Which I will swatch for you guys. I think I will. 
and I just tear the whole package apart. If it was for a gift, I would have not tore it apart, but I was going to keep it for myself this time. Hopefully it's not sticky. My, I told my daughter, says, I have no idea what any of these are like. I said, I've never heard anyone um, smells good. I like the color. I always seem to pick the same colors. Kind of a weird thing. Okay, let me wipe this off. Oh, it's got glittery stuff in it. They have the Bolero bag. The scents that they had before, they had a whole end cap just full. Now, since I know I don't like the lotions, um, I don't take baths, so I didn't buy the bath salts. Um, I didn't buy any of this stuff except for the wipes, which I absolutely love. Um, I use them every day. I think they're great. Um, I got the Argon and Shea Butter. The lavender and chamomile. So I'm pretty set for wipes right now. I have, shoot, I got six or eight of these kind. Um, excuse me. This is lemon, verbena, and mint. And coconut, ooh, coconut and mango. I know the vanilla ones smell wonderful, so... Okay. Personally, I hope pretty soon I'm done with some of this. Uh, some of these things. Um, I did find one of the praline pecan in, uh, in Old Williamsburg. And I let Bron smell it and he loved it. So it was the only one they had. So. I was looking for some for gifts, but I eh, don't want to screw on very good. Whatever. And I got three of these sanitizers because the last one I bought, I don't know what happened to it, but these are lavender scented. Okay. And then I got... This came from Walmart. These are from my little tree which I'll have to stick them on there somehow. And this is for my son-in-law. I told him to get the original. What's he get? Breakfast sausage. Original with applesauce. Somehow I don't think my son-in-law is going to like them. But oh. That's what happens when I can't do all the shopping myself. And then this one is for Bandit for Christmas. I liked this one better than the Santa one. Um, Sarah called me yesterday. She was desperately trying to find a Santa suit for um, Bandit for Christmas, but all they had was uh, mediums, and that's all they had over there, too. I searched and searched. They had even a, a plaid one, but it was in the wrong. And this is a pair of slippers for my, one of my son-in-laws. Okay. Uh, let's see if I can trade out. Uh, oh, that's, we've already done that one thing. Um, I bought this for the wine for my uh, ex's wife. But so far we hadn't found any sulfite-free wine. I got to talk to my daughter in a while. And if I don't use it, I'll use it next year. Okay. Oh, this is stuff for... This don't go. That was some baking stuff. I got brown sugar and evaporated milk. I asked my son, or I mean my grandson to bring this stuff in here. So he just carried what he thought belonged in here. Okay, how are we doing for time? Okay. Alrighty, I got a box of the elbow macaroni because we were all out. We use it a lot. 
apparently Ron picked up another, another checks because this one is in a different bag. Um, these are the things, talk about having no containers, and I just got to thinking I needed a container to put some fudge in for my mother, my ex-mother-in-law to take to her tomorrow. And so I had to come up with these, which is probably good because then she don't have to worry about it. She can just throw it away when she's done because she lives in a nursing home. Let's see, and that's the rest of the tomatoes in here. And I wonder why this was costing so much. Because I could, you know, I didn't know that he was putting stuff in there. I was going to pay for it when the lady told me how much it was. I go, yeah, I'm not paying for it. I'm uh, sorry. Mm, goodness. So, uh, these are for the uh, sparkling cider for the kids for New Year's. And I got, what is this? I can't wait till I can actually, my feet are working again. I told Ron to get a box of Kleenex. I said the 160 ones. What does he get? He really did get Kleenex. 85 Kleenex. For a dollar. When you can get 160 for a dollar. And some stuff I don't. No, not that one. That one. No, not that one. That one. Okay. I got these. And I got two of these, one for Biscuit and one for Bandit for their stockings. Apparently, Ron picked these and these. I got these. The only one I saw. And I bought myself the cutest little planner from my purse and lost it. I haven't found it yet. So I just picked up this one because I have so many dates that need to be put in and I need that, something to put them in. I got these for my grandson for his um, like a camper flashlight and I bought this for myself to try to use with my um, Kindle Fire. It's the, it's made by Travel... Travelocity and it's the micro wall charger and it is the rapid charge. So apparently they, they don't have these all the time. I don't usually look at the electronics, but I heard people, you know, calling them. So I thought I'd try and see what it was all about. Yeah, my one or two packs of candy to his 25. Don't get it. All right, let's see. Uh, I think. Nope, it is not the last one. I bought two bags or two packs of these uh, gift boxes for jewelry. Because I did have some jewelry to give and I didn't have any things. And I just happened to look down. Good thing I was in a wheelchair. And saw these. They had. I got the owls. I, a lot of you have been hauling them. They look like. Um, they look like uh, pewter almost, and that like they've been painted over the, over the pewter. And I got the heart ones. And I got these because I love my Paris stuff. I'm going to do a Paris pocket letter for somebody. I don't know who yet. I don't know who. And then I got some wine glasses. I got two of these. These are for my granddaughter, Tori, and her boyfriend, Aaron. Um, I got them these because Riley has something similar to these. Right? So I didn't want to get her just, you know, something like that again. And let's see if I can find one of theirs. Uh, 
very good paper for wrapping. And then I got two of these for uh, Riley and her book, which I thought were real pretty. So, oh, here's my dog. And so, uh, let me get my one last bag. In this bag, we have a bag of onions from Walmart. So, that is the last of my haul. I hope you guys are not wonky like me. And I appreciate all of you. I want you to know that you have hung out with me and you have been so encouraging with me in this stupid foot. And I owe you all one. I have to do something. I have plans. Also, I want to tell you, please have a great Christmas. Be happy. Uh, everybody seems to be in a very good mood this year. Uh, everybody's, Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas, wherever you go. People have been just sweet as can be. Little kids, little kids helping me, of course. Which I thought was just nice. You don't see that very often. If you like my channel, give it a thumbs up. I never say to do that. And share share my channel with other people if you think it's a good channel. Yes, I'm trying to grow. I want to grow so I can have a nice, cool giveaway. I'm going to have a cool, cool giveaway anyway. But anyway, I hope you guys are having a great time. We're supposed to have a snow tomorrow. You all be safe out there. Remember the reason for the season. And I love you a long time. And stay crafty. Bye, guys.